internet the ultimate tool that helps us achieve most of the things that we do today whether it is sending a quotation to the client via gmail or posting some selfies on facebook texting on whatsapp or even taking this training it is all done using the internet but the question is how are all these websites and large number of internet technologies created well we write a software code for it and the most common language and the core technology used for the world wide web or the internet is html html stands for hypertext markup language it is the most basic building block of the web page almost every website that you have seen ever uses html to show you the content that you see on their pages facebook google amazon all these websites use html when you're browsing a website the browser example firefox chrome internet explorer etc reads the html file in background understands the code written in the file and displays the web page accordingly html was invented by team berners lee in 1990 An interesting fact here is that HTML was developed for the purpose of making it simpler for scientists at different universities to gain access to each other's research papers. But the project became a much bigger success than Tim Berners-Lee had ever imagined. By inventing HTML, he laid the foundation for the web as we know today. This is a very simple HTML page. it is just one sentence on it which says i am enjoying this html training now let us look at the html code for this web page this is one of the simplest version of the code required to build a web page it may look complicated now but don't worry <laughs> once i explain you all the elements you will be able to get it very easily but before we get into writing html code I will first teach you a bit more about something called as the HTML tags. We see that the content shown on the web page is written in plain English with some special combinations of characters in between. These special combinations of characters which are present in the HTML file are called as HTML tags. Tags are used to format the HTML documents. Tags are always enclosed in angular brackets. angular brackets are also known as uh, colloquially as you know the lesser than or the greater than equal to signs also remember that the tags are generally used in pairs the first one which is called the start tag and the other one is called as the end tag and the end tag contains a backslash character it looks something like this so this would be like a start tag and this is an example of an end tag note that all the html content to be displayed in the web page should be added between the tags an html element is all the content between the start tag and the end tag there are various tags such as html head body title etc i'll teach you about each of these tags as we write the first html code before we get to writing the html code I will teach you a bit about HTML document structure in the next video. If you want to learn more about building your website and technologies that go into it like HTML, CSS, JavaScript, etc, then check out our Techno Shorts training. As part of the Techno Shorts program, we will send one video every day to you over WhatsApp. Each of these video is 3 to 6 minute long and teaches you new hands-on practical concepts uh, about software programming and uh, things that you will I mean the things that will help you really when you apply for job as well as uh, this program also allows you to take a quiz at the end of 3 months and you can also earn a certificate This certificate can be submitted in your college as per the university rule as well as it's very helpful when you apply for job opportunities. So check out Techno Shorts right now. Click on the link in description given below and learn more.